Prey is all about seeing enemies before they see you. And for some players, a default FOV of 85 may not be high enough. In this video, we'll show you how to edit the game's files, which will allow you to update the game's FOV and increase or decrease it, depending on what you like. We'll also show you how to disable the intro splash screens, which will allow you to launch the game even quicker. Unfortunately, this fix is only available on PC, and an in-game slider will arrive at some point in the future for all game versions. If you want to change your FOV, you're going to have to be comfortable with editing some game files, which you'll have to locate on your computer's hard drive. First up, let's locate your save games folder, which can be usually found at the following address. Once in the game save directory, locate the file titled game.cfg. You can open up this file by right-clicking, choosing open with and then selecting notepad. When the file is open, press Control F to bring up the search window, and then search for the following line. You should also see the numbers 85.5656 to the right of this line. Highlight those numbers, then change them to whatever you see fit, up to 120. Though, it should be noted that the developers have warned that higher FOVs than the current default could result in more bugs, so be careful how high you go. Disabling the intros in games have become part of the modern process, and users do it to speed up the time that it takes to launch the game and reach the main menu. If you want to do this, you'll need to locate the Prey directory in your Steam Apps folder, which can normally be found in your C drive, unless you have an alternate installation area for your Steam games. Once you've located your Steam directory, head over to the following address. Now that you're here, look for the four files we've listed and change their extensions to .bak, or whatever extension you want to call it. We use .bak because it's easy to remember that there are backup files. Once the extensions are changed, you should be good to launch the game and dive right in without running into any splash screens. And that's the end of the video. If you enjoyed what you saw, be sure to like and subscribe Subscribe. Check back every weekday for another Prima 365. And for more content like this, be sure to head over to primagames.com.